It's a show unlike any prior productions the Bemidji High School Theater program has ever performed. A Josh Peterson tonight shows us how the school's adaptation of The Hunchback of Notre Dame presents a positive message out of a dark story. The bell tolls for Bemidji High School's production of The Hunchback of Notre Dame. And while there is a popular, well-known children's version of the classic story, theatergoers may be in for a surprise when they view the school's performance. It's a very different show. It's not just your normal high school musical that you go to see. Uh, this has a great experience that is for everyone. Bemidji High School's production of The Hunchback of Notre Dame is unlike any production the high school has done in recent history, meaning it created an artistic challenge for its cast members. While comedic roles were usually performed by actor Mitchell Shaw, the story of The Hunchback required Mitchell to discover a new side of performing that required special research. The big part for me actually was uh, I play a Catholic priest, so I actually had to go work with uh, Father Don and I went and sat in a couple of Catholic masses to see how they operate and what it's like to be a priest. While the show is a darker adaptation, the story of Quasimodo still rings true in today's modern world. It really incorporates the golden rule with this role. Treat others as you want to be treated. With a cast of nearly 100 performers, tech crew, and orchestra members, the memories of working together will last a lifetime. How much of a family we all are has always been my thing every single year, and I think that's the most amazing thing because it's like everyone always has a place to come no matter who you are, no matter what other activities you're in, always welcome here. With opening night fast approaching, the cast hopes that those who see the production walk away with the positive message. In Bemidji, Josh Peterson, Lakeland News. And tickets are still available. For a link to reserve tickets, you can visit our website at lptv.org slash news. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.